and she lives in Rochester, New York. So I flew out yesterday, and here we are. To cheer the Royals. We needed that little royal blue. Lots of hits and a winner. I'm a huge Royals fan since I was a baby. Since I was a child. I saw George Rye. I see. I remember Cleasonberry, the 1985 World Series. We had just gotten our first DHS player, and we recorded every game. I've been a fan for a long time. Oh, I'm hoping to see a big win. We got to make a win. We got to do this. This is our time. This is our time. This is our year. We're going to make it. Uh, I'm hoping to see the Royals win tonight because if they win tomorrow, I'd really like to see them go to the World Series because the other team I'm cheering for is the Mets, and I'd like to see the Royals and the Mets play because they're two of my favorite teams. Whole life. We would go on vacations to Kansas City, and we would go to the K with my family, and we would then... After the game, we would go to the parking lot and we'd wait for the players to come out and we'd run and get other autographs. So it's, it's a big part of my childhood. We're going to be right around um, first base, first base and uh, outfield. So we're going to be cheering them on and holding our signs proud. I think he's going to kick some butt. I think he's going to do awesome. I have faith. I have hope. I have. This is going to be your year. This is the Royals year. I'm just sort of I'm just sort of mad that not that my favorite team is not in the in here, the playoffs. Who's your favorite team? They stink, the Cincinnati Reds. Oh really? Okay. Uh oh, you're breaking your mom's heart over here. <laughs> <laughs> Who did he say? Kane. Who oh, Lorenzo Kane? Kane. Do you like Kane? Yeah. What do you, what do you like about him? Um, he's really good at catching balls. Uh-huh. And that he's like He's a really good center fielder. I'm excited. I'm so excited.